Ed Rooney. Ed, this is George Peterson. How are you today, sir? Well, uh, we've had a bit of bad luck this morning, as you may have heard. Yeah, I heard. I'm all broken up. Boy, what a blow. Yeah, yeah, well, it's uh, been a tough morning, and we got a lot of family business to take care of, so uh, if you wouldn't mind excusing Sloan, it'd be greatly appreciated. Oh, sure, I'd be happy to release Sloan. You just produce a corpse, and I'll release Sloan. I want to see this dead grandmother firsthand. Ed! It's all right, Grace. It's Ferris Bueller, the little twerp. I'm going to set a trap and let him fall right into it. Hmm? Ed, I'm sorry. You said you wanted to see a body? Yep, that's right. Just roll her old bones on in here, and I'll dig up your daughter. You know, that's school policy. Was this your mother? No, my wife's mother. Ed Rooney's office? Hi, this is Ferris Bueller. May I speak to Mr. Rooney, please? Thank you. Uh, hold. Tell you what, dipshit. If you don't like my policies, you can just come on down and smooch my big old white butt. Ed. Pucker up, buttercup. What? Ferris Bueller's online, too. Mr. Rooney, how you doing? Listen, I'm sorry to disturb you at work, but I'm not feeling very well today. And I was wondering if it might be possible for my sister to bring home any assignments from my classes that I might need. Have a nice day. <coughs> Mr. Peterson? I-I-I-I think I owe you an apology, sir. Well, I should say you do! I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-I-